Russell. That's right. Ashley Williams, she's making herself at home in someone's backyard urban oasis. Hey, Ashley. Hi, guys. Good morning. Actually, the moment we came into this backyard, I said, Kirk, who is our lovely Good Day viewer, I said, we're not going anywhere. I don't think I'll ever go home. And or if you find someone just chilling back here at 2 o'clock in the morning, that would be me. Oh, okay, uh -oh. yes, we love this peaceful patio segment, guys. Uh, we've been getting so many of them, and it's become actually one of my favorite things to do because not only do I just love getting a chance to uh, hang out with the viewers, but also it's some real inspiration. So let's meet Kirk. Kirk, Hello to you. Oh, how are you? Hello. Thanks for coming to our home. Well, thank you for inviting us. Okay, so I cannot wait to show you every single corner of this backyard. Now, when we first came back here, my photographer and I kept going, oh, wow, oh, wow, oh, wow, because that's every corner, guys. <laughs> so we're not going to show you the back end on this side, but just so people know, on that left side of the fence, what do you have growing back there? So we have uh, three different fruit trees, and we can and make jam and jellies, which end up going to neighbors mostly and friends because it's too much. Okay. <laughs> Uh, and some, you know, extra pepper and, and tomato plants. So that's our secondary garden okay. over there. Now nice. our good day reporters included included in the handing out of jam. I will <laughs> absolutely send you guys home with a, a jar of jam. Okay, just right. want to make sure. Okay, guys. So yes, they have the hot tub. You know, who doesn't love a good hot tub? We have the table setting, but it's really when you start to come to this side, guys. You know what, Steve? Let's kind of start with this back side, this fence. Tell us a little bit about the inspo and what you have going on right here. So when my daughter went into the military, um, she we had a wall in our previous house that uh, a blank slate and my daughter said wouldn't it be fun to have like you know chilies or those restaurants that have signs and so when she was gone in the military we started collecting them yeah. when she came home on leave we just plastered the wall with it and it's carried into this new house wow okay i want to actually talk about this here too you kept saying how beautiful she was i said well who is she let me tell you when it comes to shopping if you want something the best thing to do is go home think about it and then go back you went back for this six months later oh. it was supposed to be yours well you know i call her ella <laughs> she and she she spoke to me and i, I wanted to take her home I don't know why I didn't. Went back six months later, she yeah. was still waiting, and that was just my answer. <laughs> Ella was supposed so to be cool. yours. Okay, yeah. uh, let's focus on this corner here. You guys, take a look at that red nice. situation. I called it a situation earlier. It's a, it's a scale. It's so cool. So that's, uh, used to live in my father-in-law's house, and I think he, he saw me eyeing it every time we went there. Yeah. And uh, he just goes, do you want that? And I said, yes. Cool. And uh, so it lives with us now. Okay. And you know, they're, they're Two tables are fire pits, so and at night we always have a little fire here in the front. So great. Okay, so Kirk, let's go to the best part of the backyard. Let's gonna walk this way. We have about 30 seconds or so. This is, you guys, his garden. Wow. This is where he and his family have a chance to eat year round. Tell us what you have back here and tell us how much time it's actually taken for you to put this all together. So, you know, the first thing I want to tell is that any guy there that rolls their eyes at Pinterest, most, <laughs> most of the ideas here come from Pinterest, from uh, growing tomatoes and how to grow them to doing the pots. And so, we basically found out that, you know, I love cooking, and if I can not just cook for you, but specifically pick things for, you know, this is your zucchini. Yeah. It's kind of a fun yeah. thing. And so, you know, a lot of love, a lot of care in the garden, but we definitely reap the benefits from it. Yeah. Uh, give stuff to us. It's way too much food, so Got we're always it. trying to give away to our uh, family and friends. Yeah. So it's just, it's a peaceful it's thing. So it's cool. a nice place to come and drink coffee at, at the back there by oh, the, yeah. uh, Every, the There's flowers. a lot of corners to enjoy coffee. Yeah, you know, Kirk, I yeah. I play a little music there There's in the a, morning sometimes, yeah. too. It's just, right. it's just a... It's a yeah, happy that, place. That deep breath. I love that. Place. Kirk, thank you so much. Now, if you've learned nothing from this segment, it is at least men, do not roll your eyes at Pinterest. Also, Kirk is a retired firefighter. Thank you so much for your 30 years of service with the fire team. Appreciate it. All right, guys, we got to toss it back, but thank you so much. It was our pleasure. Right. Uh, and, you know, Holly is hiding in there somewhere. Oh, but, the wifey. But thanks for, for coming over and sharing right. this with us. Of course. All right, guys, yes. there we go. Back thanks to the nice. And, Kirk, thank you for allowing